So basically, I'm going to take you through some breathing exercises. Before we get into the breathing exercises, what I want to do is show you the three different forms of breathing. The upper, the mid, and the lower uh, forms of breathing. Now, I'm going to turn to the side so you can fully see how the breath works on the, um, on the lungs. So when I turn to the side right here, I'm going to do the upper breathing. And this uses actually the most energy and it gives you the least amount of oxygen, allows your body to take in the least amount of oxygen. So let's see it. So as you can see, you're only filling up the, the upper portion of your chest, so of your lungs, so the rest of the lungs isn't actually being filled, so you're not really give, taking in that much oxygen. If you imagine this being your lungs, when you're taking in the upper breath, this is what you're doing. And you're closing, and you're opening, and you're closing. Inhale, exhale, okay? And in, instead of filling your whole long, lungs like this. So now, I'm gonna show you the uh, mid-breathing. So, as you can see with that type of breathing in the, in the mid-range of your um, lungs, it takes in more oxygen than the upper um, portion of your chest, but still, it's ineffective. So now we're going to look at the most, um, one of the most um, uh, um, effective ways of breathing, which is the, using your diaphragm, which a lot of pe some people find it hard to actually breathe using the, um, the diaphragm, which is down here. You're going to push it out. Like, if you just push it out and breathe at the same time, it'll, f it'll fill with oxygen, so let's do that. So as you can see, my stomach comes all the way out, like a bear belly, but it comes all the way out, so it's filling oxygen in there. So what's happening is that, if you imagine this to be my lungs, I'm going like this. So as you can see, more oxygen is being is entering my um, lungs when I breathe with the um, using the diaphragm, opposed to breathing at the upper portion of my chest. So one of the most effective ways of breathing is actually the union breath or the complete breath or smile breathing. That's when you incorporate both all three of them: the upper, the mid, and the lower breath. So I'm gonna I'm gonna show you how to do that. Now watch the way my my um my my stomach and my chest move. So that's the lower. Now we're gonna bring it up to the middle. So now we're gonna take it up to the chest. And take the take the stomach in to push out the air. Okay, I'm gonna do that again. I'm doing it in, in um in steps. But when we actually do this breath, we do it as in, as one movement. So I'm gonna do it again in steps, so let's go. Let's do that one more time. Okay, so now I'm going to show you, just do it one, one complete breath. Okay, so when we're doing the, when we're doing the um, union breath, you can further take in more oxygen by basically raising your shoulders up to expand your lungs to take in even more um, oxygen. So let's do that. And I'm going to do that again, 
breathing to the top and then I'm going to raise my arms to show, to show you how that spin comes in. So let's turn to the side so you can also see that. Okay, so what we're gonna do, every time you do your exercises, breathing exercises, you want to do the cleansing breath. So I'm going to show you how to do a cleansing breath. Basically, you pucker your lips as though you're going to blow a whistle. And what you do is that you take in your, your complete breath and then you release some of the um, oxygen. And then you retain it and then release a little bit more, retain it and then release a little bit.